Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Daniel Mesquo. Sorry I haven't been around the last probably five to six weeks. So much has been going on. And in that time that I took a little hiatus from YouTube, um, somebody left a comment on one of my videos. And it wasn't a bad comment. I'm not going to lie. It wasn't a bad comment. But, I mean, if you ask somebody that's blind, that kind of question, depends on the person, they'll probably take offense to it. I didn't because, well, I... I just didn't. <laughs> um, well, the question was, like, what happened to your eyes? And I don't find offense to it. Some people will, like I said before. And I don't know. I feel like I haven't discussed that yet with you guys. So I want to talk about that really quickly. And, yeah. So so I was born with glaucoma. Glaucoma is, like, it's a disease. It's incurable. That little by little it goes taking your vision. Um, I was born with being able to see really good. Uh, almost 2020 and by middle school I started losing my sight little by little by little and the course of high school I started losing a tremendous amount of vision like I was able to read newspaper print before and now that the end of like 12th grade I was um I wasn't able to able to see the largest of print um I was able to see like things magnified to like a certain extent like how do I tell you guys um had a I used stuff that had like a black background with like white words and even then it was horrible so yeah I dealt with many years of like losing my sight and I was starting to get over it uh, by 12th grade I was already okay um, I started my first year of college I was doing okay and then by the first semester of college I actually woke up blind this was back in June of 2009 I woke up blind because uh, I my retina detached while I was asleep, and that was hard. Uh, just imagine not being able to, you know, go one day being able to see okay to one day just trying to reach over and look at your phone to see what time it is, and you can't even see that in front of you. Um, I thought it was like 9 o'clock at night or something, but I heard birds chirping and people talking. I was like, what the hell? What's going on? But, yeah, I went to the doctor that same day, and they said, okay, you're blind. Um, we can try to do something about it. And it's really rare when you lose your sight to red on the test when you get your sight back. You always have that risk of losing it again. So a month later, I got a surgery, and um, they tried fixing it, but it had no result. And I spent years, years and years and years trying to deal with it. And, I don't know, I did a lot of stuff, like, I tried school, I did volunteer work, and I found my calling, and one day they asked me to teach someone how to use the iPhone, because I was proficient enough, this was back in 2013, two years ago, <clears throat> and ever since then, I've realized what I'm good for, um, you know, not knowing what you're not good at, it's a horrible feeling, because you don't feel like a person, you feel like you just... I don't know, just something that's there. But yeah, I found what I'm good for. Um, I started up in technology. I started my Facebook page, iPhone 411, last February. And I've been doing that ever since. And back in February of this year, I did a YouTube. And I want to do more stuff um, geared to, like, so the audience knows about more blind people. Because I feel like us blind people, we're... They know about us, but they don't know how to approach us. Like, I work for the Brown Institute. Um, I teach technology in the Connection Point Center in L.A. And it's a wonderful experience when you teach blind people to, you know, be in the same playing field as others that are not blind. And it's really cool. So I want to let people know that come across my channel here how we're not as different as you are. Um, I don't know if that makes sense. So I want to do more... Of aside from technology and I want to do like I don't know like other demonstrations or stuff you can do that you can you know when you see a blind person you say oh okay um I learned this from watching Daniel's channel and let me see if you know if it's this correct so I mean I don't know leave a comment down below if you guys like that idea or you know you guys can always em email me um like I said, I did take a hiatus from YouTube, but I do re plan on returning starting the new year, uh, making videos regularly every Wednesday. 
so yeah I'm back and I hope you guys didn't miss me <laughs> if you do watch my channels so thanks for watching guys have a great day and Merry Christmas and I'll see you guys back here probably not next Wednesday but uh, the following Wednesday after New Year's so take care guys bye